We are shining a light on Navy officer candidate Filimoni Filimoni, who is joining us now. Do I have the name correct? You do, sir. <laughs> well, Filimoni Filimoni, uh, congratulations on, the, uh, on getting the attention. You're 22 years of age. Do I have that as Wow. Tell us about your life. Uh, good morning, sir. I came from Lemon Grove, California. So down there, over there in San Diego. So um, you're a Scotty, right? A Scotty, yes. Went to Helix Charter High School and UCSD. So practically all my education is all San Diego. So you define by your very essence what a hometown hero is. Tell us what your goal in life is. Well, sir. My dad served in the Navy as a sonar tech, so I always knew that I wanted to join the Navy. But what he told me was instead of going the enlisted route, he advised that I go the officer route. So my goal was to do as best as I could in school and then do as best as I could in the Navy. Um, so I chose one of the hardest jobs to do and I chose the submarine route. So. We'll see how it goes. My goal is to go as far as I can in the Navy and do my best to serve the country. All right, excuse me for not really knowing. At this point in your life, have you spent a lot of time already inside a submarine or is that your aspiration to spend a lot of time? No, my aspiration is to spend a lot of time in the submarine. My dad served on surface ships, so uh, it's a big shift, but he always praised the sonar techs on the submarines because that's their, that's their eyes and their ears. So. I wanted to go that route right there. So how far out are you from, from that kind of assignment? Oh, quite far, sir. I have Walk about me through it. I mean, what, how, how long does it take? I'll graduate here on March 12th, and then I will follow uh, through with schooling for six months in class. Then we'll have another six months of practical training, and then I'll get to the submarine. So I'm about a year out, sir. Oh, well, that's not so far. When you get to be my age, a year goes by like that. I mean, and you made it sound like it was 10 years off. So uh, I always hear that submariners get the best food. Is that true? From what I heard, I think it is. <laughs> How is that possible? They say that it's a big morale boost, so they make sure uh, that we get the best food. I don't know if that's true. I haven't been in the Navy that long, but uh, from what I hear, it is. <laughs> well, you know, I, I watch the movies and I see life aboard a submarine. Back in the day, was not so comfortable. Perhaps back in your dad's era, they weren't so comfortable. But now it looks like it's a little more. At least there's a little more room. Yes, yeah, sir. The boomers, especially, I think, are one of the bigger ones. So um, they should have a bit more room. I'm a bigger guy, so I'm hoping that. I won't have to turn sideways everywhere I walk. <laughs> All right. So, you know, for, guy, for guys and girls who are watching this right now, what's your message to them who are they're considering the military as a possible career? What are the uh, words of advice you would offer? I would say, sir, that the Navy's not um, just focused on physical. We're focused on the mental. Um, we really harp on school. So schooling is very important. And I think that the Navy does a very great job at really lifting us up um, through school and really getting us trained and qualified so that if we decide to leave the Navy, they'll have our back and you'll be better off for it. It's also an honorable job. Uh, I feel a lot of pride when I hear the national anthem. I feel a lot of pride when I'm doing my job. So I would say that the Navy is a good course of action. If you're really looking for something to do, really looking for meaningful work, the Navy would be a good way to go. A typical deployment, you, you spend a lot of time without ever seeing the sun or stars, right? <laughs> yes, sir. Could you go, run silent, run deep kind of thing? Yes, sir. All right, well, we wish you a speedy one year of study. We hope you get the assignment of your choice. And we sure appreciate you uh, sharing the uh, hometown hero spotlight on the Scotties. And you went to UC San Diego too, right? Yes, sir. Oh, well, it's, uh, it's been an honor to have this short conversation with you. I, I, I wish you well, and uh, I feel like the Navy's in good hands with candidates like yourself leading the way. Aye, sir. Thank you. All right. Filimoni, Filimoni. Going to be.